Glenn Petritus here for ILoveBball.com with Thomas Wimbush, a returning player for the Long Island Nets. Thomas, what do you look at from your perspective in your second year in the G League with the Long Island Nets? It's probably different than something when you first come in. Uh, you know, as a, a guy that's been here over a year ago, and I just come in to, to look to even get better and learn what I came from last year in the G League. And now that I know the game and, you know, understanding the way people play, the way the coaches coach, and it's, it's just for me to continue to learn and get better and just move forward each and every day. What is the difference in the game between your first year and your second year? Because you just said, now that I know the game. Uh, you know, just learning the flow, you know, because, like, straight out of college I'm coming in jitters everywhere and I'm I'm playing 100 miles an hour and in the game honestly it's just it's a lot slower and 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 it, at certain times it's, you can play a lot faster too so but me just understanding at what time we're, for me to play at 100 miles an hour and, and, and understand the game is it slower because of the development aspect like you are here for a specific reason and you have to work on something absolutely that, it, that comes with uh, putting the work in off 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 the court but for me, as a an individual, I have to work on certain things that I got to get better in, which whichever that may be, and understanding that the game will be slower at certain times. So yeah, it's just you know understanding and visualizing what I have to do at that point. So other than slowing the game down in your mind, what are things that you worked on between the end of last year and as we begin this year? Uh, catch and shoot threes, handling the ball with uh, confidence, and uh, you know just continuing to having the same energy that I brought off the bench from last year and continue to having that this year. And what type of player were you in college that you are different than now? Uh, in college, obviously, I was the guy to go to and me and another guy. And for, to, for a transition from that to here is just, you know, a stepping stone that I have to get over and just continue to get better. And that's probably the biggest aspect that every single person was the man on their college team. Absolutely. It's just, you know, it's, it's a big transition to go from college to pros and you just got to start all over from the start again. What is the uh, Brooklyn Nets people said to you that you have to continue to develop? Uh, just make quick decisions. You know, just for me, I have the tools to do it. You know, I just continue to grow and um, get better each and every day and make quick decisions and don't think too much. You just Just play free and shoot the ball. And how do you in your mind make peace with that? You're in the G League trying to get to the NBA, but you're not quite there just yet. Uh, you know, just playing confident. You know, I, I can't go out there and overthink the game of basketball. I've been playing it my whole life. And once I, once I get over the, you know, the, the jitters and understanding that I belong here and I can play here, just go out there and play free. And you guys missed the playoffs by one game last year. So what do the Long Island Net fans expect or what should they expect for this year from this uh, year's team? To, to get over the hump you know there's 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 so much you know build up from last year to over one game is, is just get over that hump and just to push forward you know all right so they continue to push forward thomas wimbush from the long island nets i'm glenn petritus for ilovebball.com